Hello, people. So, I'm currently making dinner, as you probably can see behind me on the stove, and I thought this was the ideal time to show you my kitchen. The new one that I told you about already. And, uh, let's start. Okay, so you enter the kitchen, and then this is the view you have. Excuse the light, uh, it's a bit weird. Then, here in this corner, we basically have stuff. And we have our little drinks bar thingy where we put all of our drinks down. Currently it's just water, sometimes it's also juice and occasionally a coke or something like that. Um, then we have shoe cleaning stuff in here. This is a very random drawer. And then we have a lot of tea in here. This is not the... You can't pull it out completely. And then we have cutlery. And that's, that's the fancy cutlery. And then that used to be full of cutlery as well, but my mom kind of put away a lot of stuff because she didn't want the new kitchen to get extremely full, which apparently didn't. And then this is all of my mom's purses and stuff. Just a uh, random drawer. Then we have the ironing board behind the uh, fridge and our old microwave, which is still usable, but just stored up there for now and you can't, it's not plugged in, so. That's very sad, I don't like our new one. And then this is our fridge with the uh, freezing, freezing part, of which I forgot the name. Fridge, generic germ fridge. And then our freezer, yeah, it's called a freezer, Nicole, good. Uh, it's kind of broken, but that's a freezer. If you were interested in our freezer, I have no clue. And then this is the best thing ever. I don't know what it's called in English. Um, but you can pull it out like this, and then we have all the, all the stuff in here. Uh, yes, we mix alcohol and, uh, cleaning items down there. And then we basically have this area where we have the glasses in here. And then down here we have the kettle, which is, for me, the most important part of this kitchen, because the most, most of the time I just drink tea. And then we have our dishwasher, which I also very much love, and I hated it going without it. And then we have the rest of our, like, mugs and p plates and stuff like that. And our sink, which is also extremely beautiful and extremely clean compared to the old one, which is nice. And then down here is just cleaning equipment and our stove uh, with the oven, which I can't open for you, but it's just an oven, you know, and then this I love a lot because that's this. I don't know, I like this, I just I love it. Our old one was kind of broken, and then we also, and I love this, have spices here the spice cabinet. I don't usually cook with spices because I can't cook. And if you're wondering what I am cooking, this could probably fog up the camera, but these are noodles, it's a um, multitushin. I have no idea what that is. If I can figure out a translation for that, I'm gonna put it somewhere here now. Um, but it's Maltoshin, and I love it. And it's easy, so I do it. Then here in the corner we have like fruit and vegetables that don't need to be kept in, that do not need to be kept in the fridge. And then up here we have my cupboard with all the bakery, baking stuff, uh, with a mixer and sugar and flour and stuff like that. I don't know why that's our baking cupboard, but it has always been, so it is now. Then a few utensils and uh, a radio for when my mom is cleaning the kitchen because she then wants to listen to radio. Uh, and then like stuff to write down the grocery list and our toaster and a bread cutting machine and our coffee machine. And then here we just have like random crap. And then we have this cupboard which basically has all of the uh, cereal and coffee and coca making like chocolate <laughs> stuff. Uh, it's just a storage cupboard, really. And our new microwave and down here is the bread storage area. Down here is this area where we just keep like um, the vacuum cleaner and, and stuff and our bins, which my dad labeled uh, obviously in German that says garbage that says packaging 
uh, which means foil and, and plastic wrap and stuff, and that says paper. Um, because in Germany we have to um, sort our like our waste into different categories so that they can get processed Caesar. I don't know why, but this is for like plastic stuff and and foil and this for paper and then you have the generic garbage which is like banana peels and stuff. Um, and then down here we have a cutlery drawer and uh, just, you know, paper rolls and plastic bags. And I'm always confused, like, what is in these rows because I never use them. This is a sharp knife collection and boris weight cutting bolts, basically. My accent shows weird there. Then this is my mom's most preci precious cooking instrument and some leftover uh, things for, like, making, making um, sections there. And then I think this last drawer, yeah, it's almost empty, it's just a bit of Tupperware. Um, but yeah, as you can see, there's a lot of space left in this kitchen. Oh, up here, I almost forgot, is basically just where the teapot and the coffee pot and also my um, stuff for my tea is in usually, but that's currently in my room. And then this, this last, this last, um, cupboard is just like the... Another vacuum cleaner, yeah, we have two. We have one which is with steam, and then this is the normal one um, that is just, just a normal vacuum cleaner. And then this is just where we put our stuff, where mom puts the stuff for the cleaning. So this was just a very short video about my kitchen. I hope you have an idea now how a new kitchen looks. I really like it. It's still a bit bare, I think. I feel like it's not as cluttered as the old one was, which is probably a good thing. And I'm now going to see if my food is ready because I'm hungry.